Lucy family hits the national stage tonight showing off their tiny house. Six on your side's Marissa Morrison explains why this episode of Tiny House Big Living might have you rethinking traditional housing options. Samantha Salinas's background in interior design combined with her husband Jake's background in architecture and construction created the perfect framework for trying something new when it comes to where they live. Tiny living uh, intrigued us early on. My parents ended up building here in the North End area and they had a big enough lot which is kind of rare for the area and um, it kind of just dawned on us one day. After posting a construction update on Instagram with the hashtag Tiny House, the family was contacted by the makers of Tiny House Big Living. With baby Enzo on the way, they had an eight week time frame to finish the 400 square foot home. And I said, well, we're not slowing down because <laughs> I'm going to have a baby like very soon. They're like, we want to come. We want to come out. And so I said, you are more than welcome. And they made it happen. They say tiny living isn't for everyone, but if you're willing to give up some space and belongings, you can get the location and lifestyle you're looking for. So being in the North End allows us to visit the park and enjoy restaurants and walk and ride bikes and do everything we wanted to do. Everybody knows the housing market is booming and it's hard to find property or it's swept out from underneath you or, you know, there's bidding wars out there. So this kind of living is, um, that was kind of our solution. The Salinas say with the growing family, they'll eventually need more space. But for now, tiny is the perfect fit. Marissa Morrison. Don't be afraid to downsize. Yeah. Six on your side. The Salinas' episode of Tiny House Big Living airs tonight at 7 o'clock on DIY Network.